vote bots, they're nothing new. Over 40,000 Google hits on the topic. Over 2,200 videos created to date. And on January 10th, 2010, my channel was hit once again. How do I know? On an average day, my channel receives roughly 150 votes, and on average, they range between 4.5 and 5 stars. But on January 10th, that spiked to over 5,000 votes, and on average, they were all one star, and all originated from one country. The clear, unmistakable sign of a vote bot. And my channel's not alone. At least three other high-profile channels have been hit in the past month with my channel alone being hit four times in the past year. Now many creationists argue that their videos routinely get one-star votes, so much so that they have to disable ratings. Clearly, both sides of this discussion must be at fault. Not so. If 9 out of 10 people who rate a video give it one star, that's democracy. It simply means your video sucks. But if 999 people give a video 5 stars and one individual releases a vote bot to give it 1,000 1 star votes, that's called cheating. The video is clearly good, but you're too much of a child to deal with that. Vote bots, and for that matter cheating of any sort, is a clear sign that those opposed to modern scientific thought have nothing to offer. It's been two months since I put forth the challenge for peer-reviewed evidence supporting creation or intelligent design. So far, nothing. You have no empirical evidence, you have no sound logic or reason, you have no peer-reviewed articles, so you resort to cheating. Well, good for you, because the one last argument you've had, that you are morally superior, is once again proven painfully wrong. It's been four years since I started my channel on YouTube, in that time, I've received over 4 million views. Many of my videos have been mirrored dozens of times. And the sad thing is, the latest vote bot, even with its 5,000 one-star votes, barely registers on my ratings. The days of misinformation are numbered. The days of superstition and fear are coming to an end. We stand at the dawn of the Age of Enlightenment, and that fact is too much for you to bear. Your actions only further weaken your cause, but unfortunately, you're too stupid to realize that.